on the off chance that somebody has something to say later. I'm just gonna send this video. Okay, here we go. Because walking started to hurt. Like, I could literally feel one side of me being bigger than the other, and it's terrible. Because people who are bigger than me used to compare um, how big my thighs were compared to theirs. Because who wants to get a seatbelt extender? Because I owe myself more. Because I had to hide the fact that I was walking slower on a cruise with my husband and our friends um, because I was completely out of breath and felt like I was going to faint. Because I have whole trainers and nutritionists in my life and around me who I asked for help. And got nothing. Because the people who know they don't hell with a flame to you start talking like they can. The death. Because it's always you versus you, right? So, like, the other me? Baby, she had her time. And it's time for her to die. Because some girl I worked with decided to fill me up and tell me, oh, it looks like you used to have a shape. What? Because I dreaded my wedding day pictures. Because I was starting to be afraid to eat. Because like, I sweat. Outside of anything, I sweat. Add more weight on top of that. It's just too much. Because I want to, duh. Because before I gained weight, um, this guy told me that he couldn't marry a thick girl because skinny girls, after they get married, get thick and thick girls get. Because I feel like an invader in my own body. I don't know who this person is. I can never connect. Because all of the things that were probably said beforehand, I can now hear. All the side comments that people make for you but you never hear them. But at your lowest, you start to hear them. They were starting to get in. Because even though I hate the gym, I go hard. If you know me, it's what I do. But the amount of effort it takes to maintain the weight that I lose is just unsustainable. Because I got a torn meniscus. The weight can't be good. Because my husband thinks that I don't like him taking pictures of me. But it's really that you're about 10 pounds heavier on camera. And I really hate the fact that I look so Because every time I saw my dad, instead of saying hello and focusing on me, he commented on how much weight I gained and what are we going to do about this? Yeah, he looked me up and down. This. Connect, cannot find your confidence, cannot find your stride, cannot find the thing that makes you you. You do it too. Because why not? You know, just why not? Because living inside of a body that you cannot identify with, that feels foreign to you, is terrible. <laughs> because someone told me that I was gaining a lot of weight because I eat a lot of shrimp. No. Yeah. That's it. Because I work in the beauty industry. Oh no, this is not like a dig at them. It's because now I know that I have the options to do what I need to do to make myself better. And it's called self-care. Because while some people got the gene to lose weight when they get stressed, I hold it. I also internalize stress. And then my body tends to hold on to the weight. It's how the doctor explains it. Which in turn stresses me out. Do you see the problem here? Because my body, my choice. Because we went on vacation to Harry Potter World. And I couldn't get on the rides. My thighs were too big for the thing to close. 
Because feeling good about yourself is important. That's it. Because my business includes body contouring. And how can I possibly do that? Sell that. And we ain't in the right situation. Physically. You know what I'm saying? I think I deserve a reset. Because I'm going to give my husband a baby. And I want that experience to be as beautiful as possible. And I don't want to have to worry about the fact that I've gained too much weight. On top of the overweightness. When I have money. Because I opened a business, kept it afloat, got pregnant, had a miscarriage, planned a wedding, had the wedding, dealt with horrible family members all during a pandemic. Because every time I gained a pound, it made it more difficult to do anything that I loved. Because Regardless of the countless molecular tests, doctors, nutritionists, everything you have to go through to go through this process, people still will tell me that, oh, you're just eating too much. Because I watched my aunt for years, yo-yo, and I got her jeans instead of my mom's. And I decided that before um, I got too much older that I just didn't want to live my life that way.